Hello! Today's video is going to be super cool and super on theme for spooky season because I thought it would be a really fun idea to try and create as many looks as possible based on Nancy Drew characters from different games using only the items that are in my closet. And I don't have that big of a closet, but I do have a lot of clothes. So I think this is going to be really interesting and really fun and I'm taking you along with me for the whole ride. Let's get started. I'm going to talk over a lot of this because I take too long to get to the point. But anyways, basically what I'm saying here is I'm going to attempt Margarita from the Phantom of Venice and I don't have her skirt, but I have this really cool skirt here and a white tank top. Let's do it. What do you think? Do you approve? Okay, now let's make ourselves look like Margarita. I'm gonna put on moisturizer because we're gonna sit in the sun like good old Margarita. You need to have your moisturizer on and you need to have your SPF. I feel like this is just gonna slowly turn into a like Rouge makeup routine video. I've never done cosplay. So I'm actually really, I mean, that's actually false. My mom and I went to go see the last Star Wars movie in theaters for the minute premiere. She dressed up as Han Solo and I dressed up as Rey. And we went to dinner <laughs> at a, a very nice restaurant right before, dressed up as these characters and people were asking to take pictures with us. Uh, it was really funny. Like, I honestly have such a respect for cosplay. Like, it's so cool. I love art in any and all forms and I feel like cosplay is such a not as talked about art form because it really is art like people are creating costumes i have a, i have like a pair of sunglasses that look just like her sunglasses and then she also has really dark red lips so i've kind of just used like these darker colors as lip liners and then it makes the lipstick look darker i'll show you when i'm done that's pretty good she's wearing gold hoops i don't have gold hoops that i can find right now but i have these this is so exciting i love my job wow Okay, we are now going to attempt Margarita's hair. I'm saying here that it's got this fun little swoop in the front, and it's really short, so this is me attempting to make my hair look just like that. Oh, good. Okay, now to really give off the Margarita vibe. These are, these are, this is Margarita. This is Margarita, holy can only. I look like I'm about to tell Nancy to change her shirt. The blouse you're wearing, you should change it. Okay, I don't have the thing she holds when she's sitting in the sun. This is a photo frame from the Medieval Times. Next look I think I'm gonna do, which is very similar to this outfit that I already have on, so I don't have to do much, is Renee from Legend of the Crystal Skull. All I really need to do is add a hat, some jewelry, and other accessories, maybe a bit more, excuse me. Anyways, all I have to do is add some more accessories, a bit more makeup, and a little thing to go over this top, and I will become Renee. So, let's do that. Okay, so I have this little necklace. Okay. You put something in it, and I'm gonna put this little tiger's eyeball. It kind of reminds me of the glass eyes that Bruno has throughout the house. Okay, she's wearing earrings, I think. So we're gonna keep these earrings on. She has bracelets on. These bracelets. And this guy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Out of this fun little sun necklace. Now she's got like some darkish kind of makeup around her eyes and blush, so I'm gonna do that. Okay, now we're gonna add some mascara. Make her eyes just look a little bit darker. And she has really pink cheeks, so I'm gonna add some blush. This is funny how this is turning out, honestly. Okay, she's got some hair kind of in the front. Here's me attempting to recreate her shorter hair and bangs with my long hair and no bangs. Um, I decided to put my hair up in a ponytail and just stick that in the hat and see where we can go from there. This is actually so much fun, holy cow. Okay, that looks pretty good. Are you ready? I don't think you're ready. Oh my god, okay, don't take any green juices for me. This is, <laughs> this turned out so good. <laughs> wow. All right, my other cat Scooby left us because he wanted to go be in the living room with plants. Next on my list that I think I can do is Ethel. Yep, I know, I am like pro Ethel slander, but I think I can pull off her look. We're gonna try it. I'm back, explaining that I do not have a black turtleneck I can find, but I have the sweater, kind of. So I'm going to attempt to create a turtleneck with leggings. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, this is my everyday life, so we're gonna just move, keep moving on, like nothing's going on. Like I have on a um, scarf. You're just stealing the show, aren't you? <laughs> this isn't working like I thought it was gonna. Oh wait, 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 wait. Wait, it is, I lied. This is working. Okay, okay. I figured it out, but I'm using a pair of leggings wrapped around my neck. I don't recommend doing this. If you can't find a black turtleneck, 
just done picking another costume because this making a fake turtleneck, I spent too much time on this. Anyways, watch, I'm gonna put my black turtleneck right when I finish doing this, just wait. She has her hair, just back. So, ew, oh God, oh man, oh man. Not fun at all to see come to. This is the leggings, by the way. Makes my shoulder <laughs> makes my shoulders look like they're up to my ears. Let's take these out. The bracelet's off. She has no jewelry. She has no personality. She has no soul. Her eyes are like really dark around the sides and kind of has like a wing kind of thing happening. So I'm gonna mimic that. BRB. Okay. So I kind of added like a smoked out wing. They're not even, but it doesn't matter. And she has like a darker lipstick. So I'm gonna put this one on, which is a bit darker. That's terrifying. That's actually terrifying. Hello. I'm Jane's tutor. Is this what your uh, sleep paralysis demon looks like? Cause I'm pretty sure mine also looks like this. Yeah, this is terrifying. I'm never doing this again. Thanks. Okay, that was terrifying. Sorry for the jump scare. Okay, the next character I am attempting here is Lupe from the White Wolf of Bicycle Creek. She is one of my absolute faves. Okay, excuse my disheveled look. I am currently in between looks in the moment, but I'm going to take this yellow sweater here and a green scarf and do what I can with that to attempt Lupe. I feel like this is a very Lupe scarf. Then I'm going to get that center line ready. Okay, I don't know what happened after this, but I am a hot mess express trying to explain what I'm doing and taking way too long to do the scarf loop thing that she does. So I'm going to skip through a lot of this so you don't have to suffer through any of this. I'm going to fix my hair. So it looks more like her hair. Okay, I'm definitely gonna wear this look more casually. I look like I'm about to go see the world. But anyways, here's me taking way too long to do my hair and try and attempt her terrible cut bangs. All right, this is coming together swell, I think. Okay, this is the best. <laughs> this is the best I can do for making fake bangs. Woohoo! We're almost at the finish line, guys. This is me remembering that her hair is still half and half down. So I'm attempting to do that now, and I had to take it out of my little scarf, but it's okay now. See? Now there's Lupe. She's right in front of the window. Without a cat tree. Stuck in front of her. This is so great. I. Wow. This might be my favorite one. Even though it's like not the best looking one, but I just love Lupe. I never recorded an ending for that video. It's been so long that I have new hair and my wall decorations are finally hung up and it's almost Halloween. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my cosplay video. I know I had a great time making those costumes with just what was in my closet. So I'm sure you guys can do it too. If you guys have any ideas for any nice new cosplay that you wanna do, please make sure to post, tag us and use this hashtag here so that we can see it and you can enter our wonderful cosplay contest. I'll include the page for that down below and I can't wait to see what you guys come up with. Have an absolutely wonderful and spooky Halloween weekend. Bye guys. Just lounging in the sun, Nancy.